how to turn this into this. Grab a sphere and pull down the front. Squish in the sides, then plane them off. Bark like a dog. Mark out the jaw and shape out the back. Mask out a neck and then drag it out. Insert a basic ear shape and set it in position. Now carve out some details, but don't go too far. Hold Alt with clay build up to mark above the chin. Then mark out the cheekbones and the sides of the head. Carve out the eyes and nose and the bit above the brows like this. Like this video. Refine your work. Add a sphere and drop it under the neck. Shape the upper torso. Duplicate it and rotate it round. Now you have a lower torso. Cut out space for the arms and space for the legs. Now merge. Mark out the ribs, the spine and the iliac crest. Don't forget the collarbones too. Draw the centre of the lips and make marks top and bottom. My lip tutorial will help you here. Carve out a nose and dig in some nostrils. Time for the eyes. Mark each corner and dig in the sockets. Create a bottom eyelid. Now add in some eyeballs. Paint on some eyes and mark out the top lid. Mask out the eyelid and extract some lashes. Shape them how you like. Refine your work. Add a sphere and make a shoulder. Add a cylinder and call it done. Nobody has time for retopology, so just add your last model and project all. Duplicate the head and hide everything but these squares. Start turning them into brows until ZBrush crashes. Repeat lost work and remember to save next time. Eyebrows on fleek. I promise I won't say that again. Mask out the scalp and extract some hair. That doesn't look like hair. Make it look more like hair. Good effort. Add a sphere and position on the chest. Mirror it and make bobs. Merge it all together and start refining. Get bored and insert an old model instead. Remove the head and check nobody saw what just happened here. Fix old mistakes and shape it to the new character. Send the head and body to Blender and delete any parts you don't need. Connect the head to the body and send it back to ZBrush. Refine your work. Add in a ring and move it by the ears. Deflate the ring and shove it through her ear. Add a base skin tone and blush up those cheeks, baby. Mask out a crop top, then extract. Make it look more like a top. Paint on the lips and make the top one slightly darker. Adjust the skin tone. Insert a sphere and turn it into hair. Refine your work. Send it to Blender and add vertex colors. Now add in a plane and make it a floor. Add a camera and add a light. Copy and paste a hair strand from your last project and position it. Now duplicate it and position that. Now duplicate it and position that. Watch a montage of me duplicating this over the course of 16 years. Add a ramp node and colour the hair. Add a rim line. Add another one. Add a bone in the head but point it downwards. Make more bones. Turn the body and raise the shoulder, but not the arm. Duplicate the pose model and send it to ZBrush. Fix bad deformations caused by bad wets. Send it back to Blender and add it as a shape key. Repeat this for the crop top. Mark seams on the body. Unwrap for UVs. Arrange the UVs. Add more blusher. In fact, add red all over the place. Then turn it back down. Paint the bottom eyelid. Add eyeshadow. Improve the eyelashes. Now paint a glossiness map. Hit the notification bell under this video so you don't miss the next one. Export it and bring it into Blender. Paint some freckles. Now export the texture and add it in Blender. Improve the lighting. Now improve the pose. Be shocked at how different she looks with a better pose. Add a circle and attach the key line. Rotate it around the model until you find the best position. Improves the pose even more. Add some texture to the shirt. Paint cow print in ZBrush. Add stock eyebrows made by Nazar Nischenko and tweak to the character. I advise viewers to buy them and drop an affiliate link in the description below. Gloss over lots of minor tweaking and hit render. Gloss over more minor tweaking and export all the passes. Bring them all into Photoshop and colour correct until the cows come home. Pun intended. Cheat some eye highlights and repaint the freckles that were destroyed by denoising. Do a load more colour correcting, and there you go. Simple as that. 
If you enjoyed this video, please let me know in the comments and subscribe to see the next one. Peace.